Janet from Try It Like It Created and today I am working with the Cut Cardstock Design Team and they are featuring Royal Sundance paper on their site this month. And so what I am working with here is the Brilliant White and it's an 80 pound cover. Um, and so what I have designed for you is an SVG file that will either make notepads or note cards. And so you can see here what the file does is it will cut out and score this simple little flower design. Now if you um, were going to make this into a notepad, you would um, be just cutting this file here and I will include that SVG for you and you'll get four of them out of a sheet of paper. You want to go with something a little bit less than this cover stock for your pad of paper but um, the design will then layer on top of itself so that the cutout will be the same on each piece of paper. For the note card you're going to cut and score on your machine and then, um, and I used a Cricut Maker. This is 80 pound cardstock. I cut it at a setting of 100, just one time through the machine and it worked out great. Even these little teeny tiny pieces cut perfectly. You'll notice that when you fold the card over, it doesn't line up at the bottom. And the reason for that is, one, you can easily cut that off and just have a card. The other thing you could do is cut an insert, and what I've done is just take a scrap piece of paper here and cut it to the same dimension as the card itself, just a little bit shy from left to right. And then what I'm going to do is insert that here and then quickly with some tape runner right along the top edge of my card there. I am just going to center that blue sheet in there, line everything up, and just tape that in place. So now that blue piece becomes part of the front cover. And if you want, you know, you can go ahead and adhere it. If you don't want it to be loose like this, you can go ahead and run some tape runner along the bottom and attach it there as well. And so that it becomes the bottom lip of your card as well as the show through for your flower. Now, if you wanted to go and do more stamp set sentiment on the front, you wanted to go in and, and color in the center or color more around, um, completely possible to do because um, the card stock is white. But if you want a quick, simple note card, that is used, you can use for a variety of different purposes. This is a sweet little card and you, um, you know, can change out the color on the inside and make it um, for whichever color your person or your recipient would enjoy. So I hope you enjoy that.